This is going to be interesting because that means it is the top lane Swain. Uh, we'll see how that matchup is going to go. Haunts are pretty far up. Yep. Ghost being popped. Rain over going in for it. Axe one lands as the slow Hooney goes in. Blade Surge. Axe again lands. Flash out from Haunter. Has to play it safe. So Sven's here though. Teleport in. Be. There's the long lane. Magical journey in. Gonna look for the stun, but top lane play happening as well. Haunter locked down. Gonna try and make it work out, but the damage is too much. First blood goes to the Olaf. And Adrian got away. Yeah, Immortals should know what's going on because they saw Bjergsen roaming up. But here goes Sven Saren. It's Sven going in for it. Magical journey in. Byfrost looking for the stun. Gets the money onto Adrian. But Sven gonna get aggressed on by Rainover. Plus the ulti can't be disabled by the Never move. And now CSM just have to turn tail and run. Sven awfully low. Eats an axe. Rainover moving in for it. Pobelta goes for the flash ulti. Damage is down. Byfrost is dead. Horns are now forced to run as that's almost two there for Immortals. So it's is somehow still alive. He's probably going to go down here, though. Just use his E. I don't know if he's going to be able to escape. Knockup's good, but the axe is better. Pobalta finishes him off with a death ray. And they are able to take a really big team by win. What? Jeez, I'm doing trying to defend this. Horns are getting low, but they might be able to fight it out. Double lift gets one. Can he make it to Hooney? Now the next target, the culling is down. That is the double in there. Double lift going to go crazy. The 1v3 solo gets himself the triple. I guess that's what they're doing. Pick up a triple on your Lucian. And double lift comes up huge. Uh, they are gonna try to push for this turret, but the bot lane is coming, and this is a very strong double lift. Immortals will have to be careful, but their mid laner is here. Oh, arrow lands in on Tobias Frost. Rain never goes in, gets the first kill. But the rest of them are around. Hooney gonna get caught in by the never move. Now gonna take the damage in from Jerkson, who spent. Picks up the kill onto the Aurelia. One for one so far. Pobelta though with the ulti doing damage. Turtle gonna get chased down the culling. Straight into the face, Ilian ulti. Saves his life. And now Bjergsen gonna keep looking for them here. Needs a stun. Bomb flash by Adrian is Rainover now. Maybe the target slow in there. Slow from Bjergsen after the flash. Never move in. Lands good. Rainover getting low. Gets taken out by double for the four. Hooney does not have TP right now. Porter already made his way down. So this should be Drake, Drake TSM. Inferno once again. Looking like a little bit more like game one. Oh, Magical journey. Tempered fate. In for wild title. Oh, close. The Mantra Shield just getting him out of there. Uh, they see Adrian charging in, kind of bluffing, and they're not going to take the risk. How would I have time? Good blade set from Hooney, though. It's already been tormented, but Bjergsen's here. They're going to dive back in onto him. That's going to force the ulti out. Chrono Shift keeps him back alive, but Rainover's here in ulti. Force flash there for Hooney. TSM, nice bit of pressure. Turtle is gone. Yeah, looking for Turtle. Ghost Blade pops. Does have the arrow, but can he get out of this one? Volley out. There's for the slow. Sounds going chasing him down, though. Umbara is going to come through soon. That should be the knockup. No, he misses it barely. Gets Arrow. Turtle still on the run, but Double is going to fire out the culling. Turtle still living. Pops the heal for now. So He's delaying gonna... really well. Yeah, they're going to keep chasing, but the chilling smite should slow him down enough. Ventura going to chase him. He will die, but great time by... bought there by Turtle. Ooh, Pobelta got low. Ulti in the middle, though, as Bjergsen saves Haunter. Immortals are trying to go for a trade on the other side, but Bjergsen flashes in, gets himself exhausted. So he is having a good game on the Victor. Bjergsen are going to try and line it up. Tempered Fates in. Can they get the bomb combo? There's one. There's two. They get the double stun. But Pobot against the ulti out. Spence Garen, though, takes him out. It's a, a good pick off. But here comes Haunter. Yeah, Haunter actually in a kind of a 1v3 right now. Spence Garen going to get aggressive by Huni. But Byfrost, no, it's actually him that's caught. Arrow from Turtle lands in on one. But it's not enough to save Aurelia. So TSM is going for the Baron, but this is risky, this reminiscent of the Rift Herald that went so bad earlier for Immortals. A little too risky, perhaps. Haunts are going to zone out. They're going to try and find a kill here. TP in from Bjergsen. He's back alive. Ulti good. Lands on a Pobelta. There's one bomb. There's two. Going to get stunned up as soon as he comes out. Haunts are now going to get ultied up, but Pobelta is going to go down to double lift. Haunter survives after the Chrono Shift. Here comes Huni though. There's some low health Double on from TSM. They bail, but Huni actually gets out from under it with Haunter on a blade surge. That's when Skaren taken by, but Huni bombed away. Never moved, and TSM claimed the counter kill. TSM straight on to Baron. Immortals, they will spot it with the Hawk shot. They're not sure they can do a whole lot else here. Looks like they're going to try and commit for it. Immortals, do you have the steal in you? Ulti out. He's going to get onto Spence Garen. Rain have already popped that ultimate. TSM actually pull off the Baron. Rain over going to try and wait out the ulti. Going back in. A little awkward, calling out Pobelter with a nice ultimate, and TSM have to bail. Yeah, good ultimate from Pobelter, kind of saves that fight, honestly. Band-aided a lot of the wounds that they have had. We can see another all coming out, though. This is this time onto Adrian, but Rainover may be caught, forced to pop the Ragnarok. The damage is still there, though. Double him, absolutely shredding through the Olive, but Pobelter answers with a huge ulti. Double him, gets done by the arrow, but the Zillion ulti's on. Biofrost may be not so lucky as the TP's in from Immortals. Never move, locks up so many members as Hooney has to turn back with his team. Baron's still up on the map as well. Definitely a key one to look at. Ulti in, finds Turtle. Bjergsen gonna get with the double bombs in, never move combos in, but Turtle somehow flashes out of that. Now Haunter gonna be the Asho and get blown up with a zillion ulti there. Oh no, he's Zonyas. 
He's gonna keep fighting though. He's gonna go down now. Has to flash out because the ulti's worn off. Goes for rain over. That's Garen Hooney going in. Rain over popping through, but he doesn't have the ultimate anymore. Sven though, finally the only one caught out. Shut down by Pobelta. TSM have to do something here though, but Immortals, they know they'll force the Baron. Yeah, they, they may just straight up go for it. A uh, is very low. Oh, he's back again, but Pobelta just blows people up on the backside. There's the Zillion Ulti coming up, but there's the first kill onto the Karma. Haunter though, running interference in the backline, healing for so much, but not enough. Huni takes him out, but TSM, I think they thwarted the Baron attempt. They have to back away. Spence Garen taking a lot of damage for this. Will they commit? Haunter looking for someone, finds Adrian. Now Rainover have forced to pop the ultimate. Huni's in though. Biofrost gets a good temper fate. Locks down Pobelta for a little while longer. Oh no! Huni doesn't go in, and now Spence Garen's into the back lines, running interference. Rainover gonna go down. TSM, an unlikely 5v3. Uh, but that is costly uh, for Immortals. We'll see what they can do. Spence a little low, but Huni gonna get caught. Karma speeding everybody up, but double it back into the fight. Huni slowed so, so long by the Rylai's of Haunter. Uh, it's very frustrating. Oh, Biofrost Fish, he doesn't land the ult. Almost a juicy one, but now Immortals maybe feel like they can fight. Rain over gonna get slowed. Bombs in, Arrow misses! So it's Garen knocks up Rain over, but the Olaf's tanky. Still got the ultimate Haunter though. He's gonna leap forward. I think he has to get out of this. Pops the Ragnarok and will run away to safety. Uh, Huni and Co. They're gonna check with the Hawkshot. Yep, they've checked once, but now maybe a bit out of position. Adrian caught in the front side. Haunter with the Rylai's doing work. Pobelta now off to the right hand side. That's not where you want to be. TSM will dive the front line, and Pobelta still zoned away. But this fight's very odd. TSM can't fully commit. It's too dangerous. Well, ulti out. Firefrost tags Pobelta. Pobelta arrows in. There's the PP from Huni, but Pobelta forced to flash. Huni coming into the fight now, straight into it. Ben Skarin getting jumped out in the front lines, but the damage is there. Firefrost taking damage, even double him. Gets the first kill for it. Ulti's gonna keep them alive, and now Spence goes back! But Pobelta blows up double if TSM needs to capitalize while Turtle does go down, but a double gravity field stun is enough for Pobelta to keep moving through. Triple, Triple knockout! Knock up there for Sven, Rainover getting low, but not dead. The bomb is gonna tag him. Will he die? No! Rainover lives and bio dies to Pobelta. Immortals turn that around somehow. At the same time, Turtle drops as well, and now it is a 3v4 for Immortals. Uh, but Poe Belter is massive, and the Baron is being taken. Yeah, Immortals got it. It's okay, but Bjergsen gets the kill onto Adrian as we pop back into live. Rainover now getting chased. Cannot be disabled, though, at least for a little while longer. Haunter going to keep on him. Huni now here as well. Very cute. Surf under the Raptor, but Rainover, oh, the slows. There's a lot of them. TSM, I think they found a catch. Rainover goes Poe Belter. Very tanky, though, but Poe Belter looking to blow people up. Bjergsen with another kill. Tapping fade onto two. Huni diving back in. But the damage is massive. TSM turns things around. Immortals. They get the Baron, but it costs them a lot. Disaster for Immortals. And this could actually be uh, a lot that they're going to lose here. Look at those res timers. 50 seconds on Turtle, 50 seconds on Pobelter. A big wave here uh, for TSM, and they are going to look to push. Key decision point for TSM. They've chosen to push the top half of the map. They had pretty much, they had a bunch of other things they could have done. I guess Baron's down because Immortals took it. So they'll look to push instead. Elder Dragon still sitting back there as well, but TSM will break. Get themselves in How and hit it again on the go? top half. It's still 30 seconds. They want it. To end. All right, TSM. We'll see if they can close this series out. Next is Tart 1. Huni trying to defend, but he gets caught up by Nevermove. No, he just misses. Got knocked up by Sven, but TSM still rocking through. Adrian and Huni, can you make a miracle happen? Double him, cutting around the Nexus. Huni trying to take him out. Still in all there. And That's TSM, it. TSM, they'll take this series. Immortals will take the Baron, but TSM will take the game.